I do not have time for another one of your hunts, Master Dwarf. Ah, but this is your hunt, Captain. There's a pack of war chiefs just arrived in Noor. Call themselves Beastmasters. That does sound like my kind of prey. What do I need to know? I know you're familiar with the Kargors. I taught you everything you know about them. But let me tell you about their cousins. From Torben, what of the war chiefs? You didn't bring me here just to hunt another wild cat, did you? Just to hunt another. Pay attention, Captain. These Karagaths are a silent, stealthy breed from beyond Noorn. And they can sneak up on just about anything. And what's worse, this new beast tamer has been burning the brushlands to the north. He means to capture them, break their will, twist them into Sauron's war machine. Every war chief is a scourge upon this land. Beastmaster or no, I will end them. Whoa, slow down. First thing we need to do is foil their plans. And I see no better way of doing that than using the very same Karagaths against this orcish scum. Show me how to find one of these creatures, then. <laughs> Gladly, Captain. There's a Karagath hiding in those bushes. <laughs> There it is. Go get it. Ah, this beast does look useful. Excellent. Now listen. There's an Uruk camp nearby. This is where they're bringing their captured beasts. I suggest you take your new pet and prowl up to them unnoticed. But so many of them. The smell of all that sizzling flesh. My truth. Plans are in disarray, but there's still work to be done to ensure the Uruk never tamed the Karagaths. The war chief. The beast tamer. Aye, that unnatural fiend needs to be put down. To draw him out, use the Karagaths against his war camp. The more Uruk that die by their shadowy bite, the better. Let the Urix exert mastery over these Karagaths. Yeah, 
they're too dangerous. So much death and destruction. Scavengers are running amok. Just hordes upon hordes of filthy ghouls. Filthy ghouls? I thought all of Mordor's creatures were majestic in their own way. Majestic? Ghouls? Now you stop right there, Captain. They are an aberration. Those filthy little mongrels, hiding underground with their beady eyes, gnawing and biting and scratching and... <laughs> If I didn't know better, I'd have thought you'd see eye to eye with the little creatures. Are you... Are you comparing me with a ghoul? Oh, I'm glad this plague of ankle biters makes you laugh. Their numbers are growing out of control. They'll overrun all of Nurn. Well, you do have a point. So how can we curb this disease? There's only one way. We need to drag their vile queens from their nests and cut them down. A ghoul hive without a matron is like a meal without ale. Useless. Scurrying about with the sun in the sky. Just terrible. <laughs> No matron. Aye, not this time. Keep rustling their mounds, though. Matrons will come, I promise you. I think something just moved.
I am covered in ghoul filth. I see now why Torvin kept his distance. Good news, Talion. You still haven't matched me for ghouls killed in a single afternoon. <laughs> for once, it is I who has come up short. I'll give you that one, Ranger. But killing this next war chief is going to be a tall order. You see, he rides upon a Graug. You'll have to flood his garrison with ghouls to set our enemies against each other. If you can, Captain, we've no time to lose. I know you've got it. Give it back, you thieving jackals. Oh, fought Torben. But could you spare a moment to explain what this is all about? We've got a big problem, Talion. A very big problem. I've never known you to think anything was little, Master Dwarf. Now is not the time for jokes, Ranger. My camp was ransacked. Pilfering Uruks made off with all my blasting powder. And my brother's axe. The Uruks have your explosive powder? How did this happen? F -f Forget about that. Didn't you hear what I said? They took my brother's Axe! We'll get your axe, but I'm more concerned about the Uruks with the explosives. Do you even know how the powder works? All I know is that if you put a spark to it, exciting things happen. Surely you remember when we first met. These war chiefs may study it, learn how to make more. We must get it back before that can happen. Track split up here. You follow them to the north, I'll hunt the bastards to the south. Find them quickly, Ranger, before they can hide their new treasures.
is no time to spare. I must ride this scum down as fast as I can. You should keep your distance from me. Why? What's your point? <laughs> Sign of the blasting powder or Torben's axe. The thieves must have moved that bounty elsewhere. I need to make haste. These thieves must be stopped at all costs. Good news, Ranger. I found the damned Uruk running off with my brother's axe. A small victory. There's no trace of the blasting powder anywhere. Something that valuable, only the smuggler could deliver it to his dark master. It's better blown up and wasted than in their hands. You'll have to track down his couriers and destroy them along with their cargo. Better a slave to a cargo, and a slave got that. find and kill the smuggler and his ilk the blasting powder cannot fall into Sauron's hands Attention, Ranger! I think your raid is here. <laughs> the Butcher sending out extermination parties. They're wiping out every creature they can find. They're brutal killers, a lot of them. An ambitious war chief with a well-trained army. Sounds like a challenge. But if you've taught me anything, Master Dwarf, except a hunt can always turn against you. I'm not entirely sure what's happening in that mind of yours, Captain. But you've baited the hook now. Come on, out with it! I will bring a Graug to bear against their forces. I will show them Mordor cannot be tamed. Now that's a plan! Not very military, though, is it? You've been spending a bit too much time with me. But there's... Uh, one little problem you should know about. Despite all expectations, your problems are rarely ever little, Torben. Yes, well, then this shouldn't surprise you. These troops have already taken down a Graug. Or three. You'll need to lure out a rare, wretched Graug. 
a disgusting relative who's adapted to the poison from all the ghouls they eat. Wretched Grog. Isn't that a bit redundant? I'm not sure what redundant is, but if it means poisonous, then yes, they are extremely redundant. All right, Master Dwarf. Show me how to lure these creatures out, and I will do the rest. Just a few scouts tangling with those ghouls. They should make easy prey. may have lost his ranging parties, but as long as he remains safe in his stronghold, he'll train more of those killers. Show him the safety he can expect with a wretched Graug at his doorstep. <laughs> fear the monstrosities of Mordor. I must kill the Butcher and keep the Orcs afraid. 